Hey, it's great to be with you again today. Um, question, is anyone out there struggling? Uh, I mean really struggling. Struggling with trying to make it through another day, trying to uh, figure things out. Uh, maybe we're battling uh, relationship issues in our family. Maybe our husband or our wife, uh, we're, we're, we're not where we need to be and there's arguing and heartbreak and our children have wandered away and they don't want to hear our voice anymore. There's addiction, there's gambling issues, there's economic crisis, there's mental illness, there's anxiety and depression, there's divorce, there's... Right? The pandemic has spurred many things in many people and uh, there's this the sense of despair at times in our nation and our world of where am I supposed to go and how am I supposed to get help and no one wants to hear me and I, I'm alone. And it's hard for us to deal with those issues when we feel that way. And as brothers and sisters of Christ, we need to come together and we need to reach out into our communities. We need to hear people's stories. When people at work or in our home or in our church or in our gym or wherever it is that we're at, when we start to hear these stories, we need to act. We need to first pray. We need to second offer assistance if that person feels comfortable enough to hear us say those words, how can I help? Our encouragement, our support, and our listening ears many times are exactly what people need. And if we can steer them in the right direction to a counselor or some medical situation that they can uh, get into and maybe get some help, uh, those are the things that people need. They just don't need a, hey, well, tomorrow's a good day. Hopefully things will get better. Because most of the time, things don't get better when we're in those situations. We need help. We need someone to step up and be a listening ear and have words of wisdom, not condemnation and judgment, not simple words of, well, you're going to get over it. Don't worry about it. We, as followers of Christ, need to follow his example. We need to reach out. We need to be there in times of trouble for those around us who can use the prayers and the support that we can offer through Christ Jesus. If you hear these words today and you need help, please call. Contact the church, email me, call me on my phone, whatever. Get a hold of someone that you trust and that will care for you and help you through these days. May God continue to pour out his grace, mercy, and blessing on each and every one of us. Until we get to meet again. Amen. Amen.